Okay, this is so annoying, but I shot this video before I cooked the Malabar spinach with a Malabar spinach talking about it, but now it's gone and I don't have any Malabar spinach left, but I can still tell you about it. I was excited to work with it. It was from Kong Tao Farms, which is a popular farm Asian American refugee owned, and they supply to some of the top restaurants in LA, such as Republic and like just so many others they are pretty famous but I got the subscription box that's not sponsoring me and in it came Malabar spinach and it was so gorgeous. Now it's only distantly related to spinach, but it doesn't even really taste like spinach, but it's got these really thick fleshy leaves and it's got a lot of health properties similar to kale. And um, if you eat it raw, it kind of has a citrusy, lemony kind of taste. So while it doesn't taste so much like spinach when it's raw, when it's cooked, it tastes quite a bit more like spinach and you got to cook it down similar like you would do with a hearty vegetable like kale. It's not a quick cook vegetable and some people don't like this, but Asians like this. Of course, it kind of has a texture of okra with a kind of slightly slimy feel it's grown in a lot of tropical climates, places like India, Indonesia, Vietnam. So it's very commonly used in those kind of cookings. So today I'm just gonna make a couple super simple dishes. I'm gonna do a really nice, uh, beautiful stir fry, and then I will make a delicious and healthy curry and both really good, healthy, super nutritious meals, and I love this new vegetable.